I'm Drew Binsky, and I'm gonna show you why $10 can get you in a Ouagadougou Burkina Faso. What's up guys, I'm at the airport here in Niamey, Niger, heading for Burkina Faso, the capital of Burkina Faso, which is called Ouagadougou, the coolest capital name in the world. Try to say that five times fast. Ouagadougou, 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 Ouagadougou. We wanted to do that for years. Anyways, I'm gonna make a $10 video there because it's probably cheap, it's probably vibrant, and there's probably a lot of cool stuff going on. I know that they have one of the biggest markets in West Africa. So we're gonna go check it out, see what's going on, and you guys are coming with me. Let's go to Ouagadougou. Ouagadougou. As I rightfully predicted, Ouagadougou is full of life, commerce, and culture. My local friend Marlon picked me up, and we went on an adventure around town. Where comes the Burkina Faso? 10 US dollars equals 5,800 West African francs. It's time to see how much we can get. Marlon and I are heading to the market. What's it called? Gramashi. Gramashi. Nice to meet you, bro. Wow. We are now roaming through the market, which is really busy and bustling. There's lots of people, lots of things to buy, colors everywhere. A lot of attention with this camera, though. Hello, hello, ça va? Shea butter. Butter? No, I'm good. <laughs> that doesn't sound like very good at the moment. Ça va, bon arrivé. I'll take an Africa kitchen. How much for one of these kitchens? It's about 150. Perfect. Merci beaucoup. Do you have one of these bracelets? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get one of those small ones. That's the raffia. Yeah. Yeah. This one okay for you? Yeah. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Tu vas prendre Okay, we have made it to the food department. As you can smell, all the raw meat. Dried mango. Uh huh. You like it? Yeah, but let's let's buy it. Can you ask her where these mangoes came from? Est-ce que toi tu sais où d'où le Burkina est bien? Bobo. From Bobo. All right. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, that was exhausting. A lot of attention. <laughs> oh. What just happened? All right, to end a really great day here in Ouagadougou, Marlon has taken me to a good local restaurant. We're gonna get some local food. Okay, we have sat down at a restaurant here right on the side of the road and they have the fresh fish. I just told them to give me the most local Burkina Faso food and that's what they're giving me. It's like black peas with tomato sauce and yes. fish. Sure, I'm down. Sounds good. Okay. Make sure you always wash your hands before eating and then the meal is served. Some of you might think I'm crazy for eating oily street food here, but the truth is, I've built up quite a tolerance over the years of eating it, and if I do get sick, then oh well, it's still worth it. It's really good. Yeah. To wash down the food, I need two drinks because it's blazing hot and humid outside. One water bottle and one locally made Coca-Cola. Coke is one product that I never fail to find in any country, and it tastes just like home. In total, I got an Africa keychain, a new bracelet, dried mangoes, local fish and rice, and two beverages for $9.03. And that's what $10 can get you in Burkina Faso. I'm Drew Binsky, and if you like my travel videos, please click subscribe and join me as I plan to visit every country in the world.